I've told Deb your father's dead. It's your fault, Jessie. But he's not dead. He only left for two bags. Yeah, ten years ago. They do move stuff around in that shop a lot, though. I told Deb that he died on the way to Josie's audition for dance school. OK, great, so I killed him. Sorry, it felt right. That's the plot of Save the Last Dance. I know, I'm sorry. It was on Sky last night after you went to bed. Luckily, Dev wasn't watching because he was on his iPad. He's not dead. He's not. Billy, I'm sorry for saying that your father's dead. But trust me, when you're a mother, you'll understand. Can I talk to you about something? Why? Are you pregnant? No. OK, good. I dread the day we have that conversation. I never see any condoms in your bin and Lord knows we all hear you having sex. Remember, pregnancy is game over. Getting pregnant with Josie was the worst mistake of my life, and not just because it was with Josie. Should I go? Sorry, I didn't realise you were still here. Apparently, I tried to kick her away like giraffes at the zoo when they can tell there's something wrong with their baby, but the nurses just handed her back and told me she was fine. How wrong they were. Having Josie meant that I was stuck with your father for 18 years. Really? Imagine being stuck with the same man, trapped, unable to leave for 18 years. Lockdown. Wow. That sounds terrible.